Is Antarctic sea ice really making a comeback? Because that's what some on social media are claiming, which would be great news, right? But before you start celebrating, let's look at the facts. Yes, the continent's ice has fluctuated up and down in recent years, but small blips don't magically erase decades of ice loss. Satellites tracking Antarctica for over 20 years have shown a staggering decline. Since the early 2000s, the continent has lost about 2.5 trillion tons of ice. 2022 saw a temporary boost of 205 billion tons thanks to extra snowfall. But then the following year, Antarctica lost over 600 billion tons. One step forward, three steps back. Experts emphasize that year-to-year -year fluctuations don't mean that the ice sheet is recovering. The West Antarctic ice sheet, which sits on bedrock below sea level, remains unstable due to warming ocean waters. While the more stable East Antarctic ice sheet isn't gaining enough ice to offset these losses. The truth is, if you only show a tiny slice of the graph, you miss the longer term trend. But zoom out and suddenly the claim that the ice sheets are rebounding melts under scrutiny. Antarctica is still losing ice. The sea levels are rising and short-term snowfall spikes don't change the bigger picture. Claims that the ice sheet is bouncing back ignore decades of scientific data and put a misleading spin on a very real climate crisis. 